Much of magic, as I understand it, in the Western occult tradition is the search for the self with a capital S. This is understood as being the great work, as being the gold of the alchemists sort, as being the will, the soul, the thing that we have inside us that is behind the intellect, the body, the dreams. The inner dynamo of us, if you like. Now, this is the single most important thing that we can ever attain. The knowledge of our own self. And yet there are a frightening amount of people who seem to have the urge not just to ignore the self, but actually seem to have the urge to obliterate themselves. This is horrific, but you can almost understand the desire to simply wipe out that awareness because it's too much of a responsibility to actually possess such a thing as a soul, such a precious thing. What if you break it? What if you lose it? Mightn't it be best to anesthetize it, to deaden it, to destroy it, to not have to live with the pain of struggling towards it and trying to keep it pure? I think that the way that people immerse themselves in alcohol, in drugs, in television, in any of the addictions that our culture throws up can be seen as a deliberate attempt to destroy any connection between themselves and the responsibility of accepting and owning a higher self and then having to maintain it. 